and welcome back to another video. is a glow up video the past week i've been a bit iffy like i'm not really bothered my hair my hair has looked like this for the majority of the week i haven't stuck my nails on i haven't reapplied my fake tan you know i've been on feeling a bit shitty so i thought today i would film a glow up video i don't know if i spoke about this in the video yet but i'm actually back at work tomorrow Ooh, i'm nervous so tomorrow is friday Basically, I think it's just like a reintroduction thing. And then the next two weeks, obviously the shop isn't open yet, but we will be back just to sort the shop out, etc, etc. So for everyone wondering, it's probably going to be the 12th of April. The only reason that would change is if like Boris Johnson decides to push the roadmap back, but it's no earlier than April 12th. I thought when I have a bit of a glow up, I need it and it's something to film. So here we are. So I don't need to paint my toenails because my toenail as my toenails, like my nail varnish on my toes, has actually stayed on for once. I decided I'm gonna get in the shower because I've got stuff I still need to do. It's like 20 past 12 now. So I'm gonna quickly get in the shower, literally wash my hair, scrub my body, try and get all the fake tan off. And yeah, then I'm gonna fake tan. So I stopped filming the last clip because I couldn't decide whether I wanted to film this video today or on Saturday because I need to get stuff done, so I didn't want to fake tan and I have to wait for it to thingy. But then what I'm going to do is I'm just going to fake tan my whole body, then instant tan my face. Because basically I don't want to tan my face like with like gradual tan, then put like makeup and stuff over the top. Then once I've done everything today, then I'll put the other tan on my face so that can develop later. Um, obviously when I'm not doing anything. That's why the clip sort of just ended last time, because I only decided to do that in the shower. So here we are. I've shaved, I've exfoliated, um, literally looking as pale as I've ever been. So I'm gonna fake tan. I'm still using the Jack Jossel one from Be Perfect. What do I need to do after that? I've done my eyebrows the other day, so my eyebrows don't even need doing, but let's just pretend I've done that and my toenails just to get more content in the video. <laughs> I need to dry my hair, but I don't have to dry it first, then tan, or tan and then dry it whilst my tan's doing its thing. I don't know what clips you're gonna see next, but good luck. So I'm just gonna fake tan what you can see on camera and then i'll do the rest off camera but i need to fake tan basically i've just put some pasties in the oven and um, you know like the greg's ones from iceland um and they take half an hour so i'm trying to fake tan and at least started to dry my hair before the time is finished you know but i might fake tan then eat then dry my hair i don't know maybe i can get both done within half an hour imagine that uh, i'm just gonna start with my legs i always start at the bottom up obviously this isn't like a fake tan routine which i can do if you want me to do let me know yeah and it's really weird because i never ever fake tan with clothes on i need to tie my top up because it's gonna get in the way i was gonna say so as if you can see my nips from my t-shirt but quite frankly i'm not asked we've all got them basically i got a blister right if you don't like stuff like that then you know don't watch but basically i've got a blister and like I just left it and then like you know this it, this is gonna be so so rotten but you know when like this like when you leave it it sort of like pops by itself yeah I did that but because then the skin was all saggy <laughs> I like pulled at it and like it came off in a circle so now obviously it's healing now like I can touch it and stuff and I don't need a plaster on as much now but it was knacking the other day um, yeah, I thought I'd just show you that because I'm not really sure what to do with it with my fake tan. Do you think I should just go over it? But then I don't want to irritate it because it's obviously healing. Oh, fuck it. I'll just go over it. I'm not bothered. Let's go. Let's go. Do, 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 do. Let's go. I'm in such a good mood today. And I've got a coffee. Got my coffee. Mm. It's a good one today. I don't know why I'm like blowing up to go to work for one day. I'm not actually doing it for that. I, I'm due to do it anyway. So even if I wasn't going to work, I would have done it today. I don't even think I fully got my tan off like when I was in the shower to be fair, but I don't really care. As long as I don't look pale, I'm sound. I actually thought I'd finished my period and I haven't, which is really annoying. You know, and it's like, she's like, yeah, I'm done. And then she's like, actually, I'm not, I'm back. And I'm like, ugh, bitch. She back, bitch. Okay, now time for the other leg. I'm buzzing for my pasty like. I've never fake tan so much in my life. More than like this year, like of COVID. Oh, I've got a patch there that just won't tan. 
Right, I'm gonna go and finish the rest of my tan. I just need to get it done because it's gonna like go bodged and I don't want it to. I've done my tan, I just haven't done my neck or my face because I'm gonna use instant tan like I said earlier because I wanna put my makeup and stuff on. But the rest of my tan's done so I'm just gonna let that obviously develop over like, I think I'm gonna keep it on for about three hours. So I ended up getting me pasty. There was only five minutes left on the timer so I just waited for it. I had to exfoliate my nose because it was so dry and like, I just think my skin hates me at the minute. It's so textured, so dry, like I've got spots. Obviously I've been picking at them now so they look worse, but yeah, I got, I, well I got, I made a sausage bean and cheese melt. Possibly be my favourite thing from Greg because I know how boring. What I'm going to do now, obviously pasty isn't part of the glow up. So I'm going to eat my food, then I'm going to come back and we'll dry my hair. We'll dry my hair. You'll have to get me through it because I really can't be bothered to dry it. But the only reason I'm drying it is because I'm filming. So that's why I'm saying we'll get through it and we'll dry my hair. Well, that'll do. I can't be bothered to dry it anymore. It is pretty. Mu it is pretty much dry, to be fair. I'm just gonna put some instant tan on. It blends out, by the way, before anyone starts questioning the colour. But literally it's not perfect what you know it'll do basically what i do next right is a proper weird step because i would never ever do it before but i tried it once last week and it actually worked so it's now putting my moisturizer on like on top of the fake tan even though it sort of contradicts it it brings the fake tans down slightly so it's not as like in your face but also moisturizes my skin which is what my skin needs i love my big tub of moisturizer but yeah i'm just gonna get on with my makeup now i need to get it done so i can actually get out and take some instagram photos <laughs> my bag is aching my brows are tight my booty shake from the left to the right i've got the song stuck in my head Ooh, my literal face looks minging <sighs> oh, i hate makeup me i hate it I hate it I'm stressing, I'm stressing. Oh, get it off now. Get it off my face right now. I would just like to clarify that this has nothing to do with the makeup products themselves. I actually tested them out again on another day. It was just one of those days. It was the time of the month. And when I get super stressed, I just don't care. So excuse the fact that, you know, any swearing or anything. But, you know, it's all real. It's it's what happened at the time. And it has nothing to do with any of the makeup products. It was literally just... It was one of those days. Literally. One of those weeks, I think. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. You sound. You absolutely sound. Just take it off. Reapply the tan. And carry on. It's nothing to stress about. All good in the hood. Worst things in the world could happen. One of those days, you're fine. Look, it's come off. Can't believe that it's just happened. Like, oh, I'm stressed. How people wear this shit every day is actually beyond me. Cause I have no idea. I could not do it. It, it, oh God. Let's start again. I'm not gonna show you any of this because we've literally just sat through it, but I'll come and see you when I've done my makeup. So you need to put some music on, chill, do it, get it done, and then I'll be back. Oh my God, I'm actually sweating. It's boiling. I can't open the window though, because they don't work over there, so I don't want it to like, I can't find my eyebrow brush, and I need to brush my eyebrows out. Oh, do you know one of those days when nothing goes right? Do you know what, I'm doing all this, and the frigging sun's gone, so I don't even know what I'm doing this for anymore, because that was the only reason to take Instagram photos. So basically I've just done this makeup for absolutely no reason and I could have had my fake tan on. So this is pretty much as much of the glow up as you're gonna see. I wanted to do my nails but I honestly don't know if I can be bothered. Oh my god, what a shambles this video. I can't <sighs> I'm too warm. I'm gonna come back once I've took my makeup off because it's stressing me out. Like, does it I actually wanna see what it looks like on camera because the thing is right, it doesn't even look that bad on the camera, but it just looks like orange and like grey and my eyebrows just look so like blocky and minging and it's just not the look for me today. I'm just not and I'm not I'm not even gonna force myself to wear it because there's no point if I'm not taking Instagram photos. I mean I don't necessarily have to wear makeup for me Instagram photos, but like I've just wasted like a whole two hours like doing this for, for what? For what? You did that for what? 
it's just because I feel like I've ruined the video now because I want to take my makeup off. I'm just going to end the video here because I'm stressing myself out too much thinking about the video and stuff. But I hope I got enough content for you and I hope you, like, you know, to be fair, it was a glow up me. The fact that I got in the shower, washed me and actually dried it and didn't just shut it up in a bun. And also the fact that I put fake tan on because I haven't put fake tan on in like a week. Something like that. So, you know, it's half a glow up, you should say. Um, but that is the end of the video. I hope you all enjoyed. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to my channel, turn on the bell notifications, comment down below anything you want to see in the future and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.